G'day everyone, the time has come to draw the winner for the Strike Tiger Lua giveaway. I have to say that this has just been absolutely overwhelmingly successful. When I started this competition, I was sort of flying by the set of my pants. I had no idea what I was going to do. And I thought, I might get 50 or 60 entrances if I'm lucky. I think I've got about 600 to be quite honest. <laughs> this has been a seriously steep learning curve for me. I've learnt a lot of things. I've learnt that a lot of people that are on Instagram and Facebook may not necessarily have Google accounts, particularly kids, but I still want them to enter because they support my channel. So I've had to write down everybody's name. I've been flooded with inboxes from people on Instagram and Facebook. All week it's just been a constant flow of people saying, can I enter? I'm sorry I don't have a YouTube account. You guys support me. You watch my videos. That's all you've got to do is watch my videos and you guys do it so well. If you didn't watch it, you wouldn't have seen the competition. So of course you can enter. But it's created a stack of work for me, which is why it's taken me a few days to get organised. Now, what I'm going to do, I'm going to write down everybody's name. I'm about to scroll through all of my YouTube comments. And I'm going to write down individually the names of everybody that commented on the video and entered the competition. And I'm going to throw them in this DJI box here, because I bought a new drone. <laughs> I'm going to throw them all in that drone box, and I'm going to draw one out randomly. Now, check this out. If you have a look, you'll see... You'll see that there's already quite a few names in there. They are people that have already entered. They're the people that have already entered via Instagram or Facebook. The people that, they're the people that don't, don't actually have YouTube accounts. So I've got about 10 times that many names to write down. I'm going to write them down now and then I'm going to randomly pull a number out of a hat or pull a name out of a hat. Now, I just need to say something and be excited. If you don't win this competition, which most of you won't because there can only be one winner, Hang on tight, because I have got another competition coming up next week. I kid you not, one of Australia's leading tackle companies has sent me some stuff to do a giveaway. So I've got another giveaway coming next week. I'm staying tight-lipped at the moment as to what it is. I'm hoping to be able to announce it on Tuesday night, if all goes to plan. So if you don't win now, hang on tight. There's another competition coming up. I better start writing, because I'm going to be here for quite a while. <laughs> hard work. It didn't take long, did it? <laughs> I was taking one photo every three seconds on my Canon M6 and I took almost 1800 photos. <laughs> it's taken me close to 45 minutes to write all these names down. Look at all these envelopes. Why on earth did I write them on envelopes and not a sheet of A4 paper? Anyway, I have literally got hundreds of entrances here to write down. I'm going to write them all down and cut them up and put them in the DJI box. Have a look at this. Now when I take, when I, when I get the, when I draw out a winner, when I go to mail the prize off, I will be uh, probably buying some more envelopes while I'm at the post office. <laughs> There's the M6. Sitting there with a flat battery because it just took like 45 minutes solid time lapse and I don't know how much power it had in it to start with. Wow. Well, well, better start cutting. Wow, look at all these names. Put them all in the DJI box. Look at them all.
Have a look at this one. If I draw this guy's name out, I'm going to be in a hell of a mess of trying to pronounce it. Is that the right way? Did it go that way? I don't know. <laughs> but the comment was in English, even if the name's not. But he's entitled to enter this like everyone else. Everybody is in there. Look at all these names. The time is now. <laughs> right, yeah, I'm gonna draw the prize. The time has finally come for me to draw a random winner out of all of these 50 gazillion entrants. This is going to be awesome. Don't forget, folks, if you miss out this time, don't worry, because I have got a fantastic Zerek giveaway coming up later this. Did I say Zerek? I've given away some cod lures later in the week anyway, that's all you need to know. This audio might be crap. This G7X has got fantastic inbuilt mic, but I want to stand right back there to make sure that you can see that I'm not looking. And I need the uh, the big microphone that goes on top of here, which is this one. You see that? It goes into the M6 really well, but it doesn't fit on the G7X. So I've got no external mic. Maybe I could just yell. Anyway, drum roll. Why am I still squatting down? I actually fit in the frame now. Look at all. I'm sure we've got some falling out. Hang on, I've got to put them back. <laughs> right, yeah, they're all in here. See, look. Everyone is in there. Okay. Shaking, shaking, shaking. I don't want to do it. The other day, I went in for a job interview, and I was sitting there, and they were asking me all these questions. And then they asked me a question, and I, they asked me the question, where do you see yourself in five years from now, Robbie? And I said, uh, honestly, I think my greatest weakness is probably listening. All right, the winner is, the winner is, I've got one or two. I've got two. This one. The winner is. The winner is. Who is it? I can't see. If it's that Chinese dude, I'm going to be in trouble. The winner is. Burb. B I R B. That's like bird, but with a B, so burb. Now, Burb, what you need to do is you need to establish contact with me. You can send me a message on Instagram. You can send me a message on Facebook. You can ring the Wangaratta Chronicle or Northeast Newspapers and pass a message for them to give to me with your phone number and I'll call you back. But you need to establish contact with me, Burb. What is it now? It is... It's the 12th of May. If I haven't heard from you by the middle of June, I'm gonna give you four weeks. I'm gonna give you four weeks. If I haven't heard from you by the 15th of June, I will uh, have another competition. So Burb, get in touch really soon. That'd be my tip. Thank you very, 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 very much to everybody that entered this competition. This is the first time I've actually done a giveaway. I have got another giveaway coming up very soon and I've already spilt the beans. So it's for Zerek. I've got four Zerek soft plastic sections. It might be just here. I've got these. 
Can you see? So that's my next giveaway, folks. I've got those four Xerox soft plastics, Xerox flat shads coming out. Hopefully this Tuesday night, I'm hoping to have that competition up by. If not, it'll be later in the week. So stay tuned for another great giveaway next week. I'm going to be doing things a bit differently this week. This is the first time I've done an online competition. I was flying by the seat of my pants. I was, I was traveling blind, so to speak. I've never done this before. I've learned a few things about some people that are on Facebook but not Instagram, some people that aren't allowed to have YouTube accounts, some are on YouTube but not Facebook and Instagram. So I'm going to try and do it a little bit differently this time. And also I've got to do it in a way that doesn't create probably four hours worth of work for me because it's taken a lot to do this. I can tell you it's been pretty epic. Anyway, thank you all very, very much for entering. Good luck with my next giveaway and I hope you're all having a wonderful weekend.